N. C. Wyeth, born in 1882, was an American painter and illustrator. He studied under Howard Pyle, one of the most prominent artists of his time. Wyeth gained fame as one of America's most renowned illustrators, creating over 3,000 paintings and illustrating 112 books. His illustrations for Scribner's, especially the Scribner Classic series, are considered his most notable works. One of his masterpieces, Treasure Island, helped fund his studio. Wyeth was a realist painter during a time when photography posed a challenge to his craft. His illustrations, known for their quick comprehension, were sometimes criticized as melodramatic. In 1908, he acknowledged the distinction between painting and illustration, stating, painting and illustration cannot be mixed, one cannot merge from one into the other. In addition to his own artistic achievements, N. C. Wyeth had a lasting impact on the art world through his family. He was the father of Andrew Wyeth, a well-known American painter, and the grandfather of Jamie Wyeth, who also gained recognition as an artist. N. C. Wyeth, born in 1882 in Massachusetts, was deeply influenced by his family's rich history and traditions. His ancestors had played significant roles in historical events such as the French and Indian Wars, the Revolutionary War, the War of 1812, and the American Civil War. Growing up, Wyeth's family passed down stories and oral histories, which became a major source of inspiration for his art. His mother, who had connections with literary giants like Henry David Thoreau and Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, also nurtured his love for literature and art. Wyatt's upbringing in a family that cherished outdoor activities greatly influenced his artistic style. He and his three brothers spent much of their time hunting, fishing, and engaging in various outdoor pursuits. This love for nature is evident in Wyatt's paintings, as he often depicted landscapes, seascapes, and wildlife with great detail and realism. His ability to capture the essence of the natural world made him one of the most celebrated American artists of his time. In addition to his love for nature, Wyeth was also known for his illustrations of classic literature. He created numerous illustrations for books such as Treasure Island, Robin Hood, and The Last of the Mohicans, bringing these stories to life with his vivid imagination and attention to detail. His illustrations not only enhanced the storytelling experience but also showcased his versatility and mastery of different artistic techniques. Despite his success in both illustrating and painting, Wyeth's life was not without challenges. Tragedy struck in 1945 when his son, Andrew Wyeth, suffered a fatal accident. This loss deeply affected Wyeth, and he began to withdraw from public life. However, he continued to create art until his death in 1945, leaving behind a legacy that influenced generations of artists. In conclusion, N.C. Wyeth, born in 1882, was an influential American painter and illustrator. His extensive body of work, including over 3,000 paintings and illustrations for 112 books, solidified his reputation as one of America's most renowned illustrators. Wyatt's ability to bring literature to life through his vivid imagination and attention to detail is truly remarkable. Despite facing criticism for his melodramatic style, he remained committed to his craft and recognized the distinction between painting and illustration. Not only did Wyeth leave a lasting impact on the art world through his own achievements, but his family lineage also contributed to the artistic legacy. His son, Andrew Wyeth, and grandson, Jamie Wyeth, both became recognized artists in their own right. N.C. Wyeth's love for nature, fostered by his family's appreciation for outdoor activities, is evident in his realistic depictions of landscapes and wildlife. His ability to capture the essence of the natural world further solidified his status as one of the most celebrated American artists of his time. Despite personal tragedies, including the loss of his son, Wyeth continued to create art until his death. His legacy continues to inspire generations of artists, and his contributions to the art world will always be remembered.